Well, even the mayor's throwing shade. So that was Oklahoma City Mayor Mick Cornett saying he thinks Kevin Durant made a mistake by leaving the Thunder because he would be much more popular if he won with OKC than instead of the Warriors. Max Kellerman, is the mayor correct? He is correct in the very narrow way he's discussing this. So look, will he be, would he be more famous if he stayed in OKC? No. He's more, he'll be more famous winning championships in a bigger metropolitan area. His brand will be stronger in that sense. But would he be more popular if you could somehow measure the love of the fans of that team and around the NBA for sticking it out in a place and eventually winning a championship? Yeah, he'd be, he'd be more popular not more famous, brand wouldn't be stronger, but people, more people would have more good feelings about him. And of course, the mayor of OKC is going to stand up for OKC. So in the very narrow way he defined it, had he won a single championship in OKC, sure. But that's not what, really, what we're really talking about. And the mayor should also not make assumptions about what's important for KD. Because KD, to my eye, looks very happy where he is. KD would not be more popular if he were in Oklahoma City as opposed to winning in Golden State because Oklahoma City ain't Golden State. It's just that simple. I mean, when you look at the Warriors right now, they are the show in the NBA. I don't even have the numbers in front of me. I have no doubt in my mind that Joe Lacob, Peter Goober, and those guys, they have the number one organization in the NBA. To, in terms of people walking through the turnstiles, not just at home, but on the road, they are box office and Kevin Durant despite playing with the Splash Brothers despite playing with Draymond Green and he's got to show up and play big in the NBA Finals we'll ridicule him if he doesn't etc etc but there is no denying that Kevin Durant is the second best player in the world with his skill set and what he brings to the table with the efficiency with which he plays playing on the number one marketable team in the entire NBA there is no way in hell that he would have been more popular had he won a. at OKC rather than Golden State. Stephen A., when LeBron James left Cleveland the first time, he became more famous, his brand was amplified, he went to a bigger market with better teammates and won championships, and in that sense, his brand was stronger. But was he more popular? If you could measure the love for him and also weigh the hate, was he more popular? In Miami, then in Cleveland, I would argue no. Yes. And going back to Cleveland, yes, he, was. Pop, he became yes, more he was. popular. Yes, he was. The height of LeBron James' popularity was when he was hated because you had to take Fame. a side with him before he was just loved. When he was in Miami, he was hated and loved. He was, it was a, there was no middle road. There was no neutrality when it came to LeBron James once he departed Cleveland for Miami. His popularity was at an all-time high popularity once he went to South Beach. Clutch. Popularity implies that people like you, right? That's what we're no, talking about. No, 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 yes. no, no. That, that is, I'm, I'm evidence of that, man. Hold on. I am. I can speak. I am an expert on this because you love me or you hate me. Ain't no middle road with me, baby. You understand? You love me or you hate me, and That's that contributes fame. to popularity. That That's is, fame popularity. and notoriety. That's well, not popularity. Like a Q well, rating me. is not just about Depends how many how people you look like. At it. Depends on how you look at it. It's about what you benefit. It's not just about how many people know you, which is in the TV business or in the entertainment, the Q rating. It's not just how many people know you. It's how they feel about you. Are you liked? Are you popular? KD, more popular if he stays and wins a championship, more famous if he leaves. Same thing with LeBron. Well, here he we, became well, less well, popular here we go with more the, famous. Here, here, here we go with the dictionary definition in terms of instead of a conversational de definition. Because when we uh -huh. speak about popularity, it's not just about being liked. It's, 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 about, it's about people feeling something for you. Recognition mm -hmm. is the operative word. So if you want to get technical about it, sure, I guess you're right. Because popularity means like. That's not my definition of it in this I business see. when we're, we're talking about today's definition. world. Gotcha. Popularity is about you being people know you and have a take on you one way so let me or ask the you this. other. That is let me ask sure. you this. If you sure. could weigh the love and weigh it against the hate, let's change because, because we're, we're working with different definitions. Mine's the, re the sure. regular one and yours is your own. But, but if you could, if you could <laughs> weigh the love against the hate, would KD be more popular? Would, would he be more loved if he stayed in OKC or if he went to Golden State? I think that he would be more loved if he stayed in OKC 
but I think the more people have an opinion one way or the other about him now that he's going to Golden State. So the notoriety, the recognition mm -hmm. is elevated in Golden State than it would have ever been in OKC. And to me, when I think about popularity, that's what I'm thinking about. Well, that's the, the mayor of OKC was making that point. There's more love for you here, KD, but you left to be more famous. Yep. Well said, guys. I want to keep it going, though. So the Cavaliers had the opportunity. Oh, even the mayor's throwing shade. So that was Oklahoma City Mayor Mick Cornett saying he thinks Kevin Durant made a mistake by leaving the Thunder because he would be much more popular if he won with OKC than instead of the Warriors. Max Kellerman, is the mayor correct? He is correct in the very narrow way he's discussing this. So look, will he be, would he be more famous if he stayed in OKC? No. He's more, he'll be more famous winning championships in a bigger metropolitan area. His brand will be stronger in that sense. But would he be more popular if you could somehow measure the love of the fans of that team and around the NBA for sticking it out in a place and eventually winning a championship? Yeah, he'd be, he'd be more popular. Not more famous, brand wouldn't be stronger, but people, more people would have more good feelings about him. And of course, the mayor of OKC is gonna stand up for OKC. So in the very narrow way he defined it, had he won a single championship in OKC, sure. But that's not what, really, what we're really talking about. And the mayor should also not make assumptions about what's important for KD. Cause KD, to my eye, looks very happy where he is. KD would not be more popular if he were in Oklahoma City as opposed to winning in Golden State because Oklahoma City ain't Golden State. It's just that simple. I mean, when you look at the Warriors right now, they are the show in the NBA. I don't even have the numbers in front of me. I have no doubt in my mind that Joe Lacob, Peter Goober, and those guys, 